Hey guys, here we are with the first movie reaction of the channel, and it's going to be The Land Before Time from 1988. Someone mentioned to me in a comment on my channel that there have been 14 of these, and I haven't seen any of them, so I figured, hey, why not, right? Uh, I was deciding between this and Die Hard, but after all of the horrible things that have been happening while I'm working on Game of Thrones, I kind of needed like a short happy, cuddly, animated movie, so I'm hoping that's what this is. If it winds up being a snuff film, <laughs> with like a Mufasa dying moment, I'm gonna cry, I swear. Uh, this is gonna be my fair use reaction, so it'll be pretty short, but if you wanna check out my full reaction to this movie, check out my Patreon in the link in the description below. You can also help me decide what movie I'll watch next there. Uh, I'll talk about which movies I'm considering watching before I end this video. But without further ado, let's get started with this movie. Try to eat it. Something bigger is gonna come along and eat that, right? No? Ooh, alligator. Alligator. Oh, he finally got him. And he's about to get eaten, too. He got away? Wow. The leaf eaters stopped only to hatch their young. <laughs> Look at those toes. Aww. Hi. Uh, 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 uh. Pretty playful. Oh my god. Mama. That was close. <laughs> Mama? Aww. <laughs> He's like trying to charge. Oh no! Uh. <laughs> and they called him Littlefoot. Littlefoot. Aw, he's scared. He likes it. <laughs> Aww. Is it for eating? It is very special. And it'll help you grow strong. Some things you see with your eyes. Some things with your heart. You with your heart. <laughs> I don't understand, mother. <laughs> nope. <laughs> what kind of bug does that? What are you laughing at? Three horns never play with long neck. Wow. Littlefoot. This got racist real fast. Three horns never play with long neck. Is it the parent again or a predator? <gasps> Shark tooth! Sharp tooth? Stop giving away your position by screaming. Whoa. Oh no. Oh no, 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 no. The mom's gonna die. The next swoops down. The next swoops down to save them. I think the mother is really hurt. Great earthquake split the land. Herds Jeez. were divided. Families were cut in two. Just jump. You can make it. You can make it. So what kind of movie is this? Are they gonna all make it to the west by event by the end of the film? Or is only a little fit gonna make it? Or are all of them gonna die on the way there? <laughs> oh no, oh no! No. Mother? Oh no. I said no Mufasa moment. God dang it. <laughs> oh no. I miss her so much. And you'll always miss her. But she'll always be with you. As Even if you can't see her. The thing she taught you. It's cute. <laughs> ah, it's too heavy. Oh, they're fighting for it. 
Get your own! Oh my god. <laughs> Aww. Do you remember the way to the Great Valley? No. <laughs> Follow the bright circle past the great rock that looks like a long neck and past the mountains that burn. Don't look directly at the bright circle, though. Be in your heart, little foot. Aww. Hello. Hi. I said hello. Aww, he's... Long necks don't talk to you. Or whatever you are. <laughs> this is so dumb. I'm a long neck, too, see? And I have a long tail like you. <laughs> is he a pter pterodactyl? Like a Funny baby, head. baby, tiny? <laughs> I, I fly? No, you followed. You I fly? Fall. <laughs> I followed. <laughs> Please wake up. That'll be so funny. Yep, tree. You keep it safe. Yep, yep, yep. Nope, nope, nope. <laughs> nope, nope, nope. Carrier, get off. Yeah, yeah. You're a flyer. <laughs> now start flying. <laughs> Open your wings, Petri. I'm gonna name you, you should Viserion. You should. You are late. Yes, you are. Yep, yep, yep. How do you know? They're late. Sounds like a pig. You are all alone. Are you not scared? He seems pretty low maintenance. He eats whatever grass there is, even though it looks like it's not the right color. Dying out, maybe. Hey, not too fast. Hey, not too fast. <laughs> Sarah is so mean. Your car looks so ridiculous. <laughs> oh no, 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 no. Oh, no. Ducky, Ducky, come down here. We've got green food. Ha 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 Is Petrie sleepwalking? I like how Spike was giving, like, that look. Aww. Whose footprint is that? Oh no. They all go? Sarah's way is easier. I think so, too. Who went this way? Ah. Makes sense. All right. Oh no. Oh no. Lava. What the heck? <laughs> Whoa, it jumped up real high. Uh... Yeah. <laughs> no, he's not dead. There's no way they kill off a character like that. This is a kid's movie. Stop! You go without Petrie? <laughs> you go without Petrie?
Remember who you are. What? Everything the light shines on is my kingdom. Something like that. Look at the valley. Whoa! Oh, Grandpa and Grandma! And Littlefoot found his grandmother and grandfather. Aww. Last. The Yay! And they all grew up together in the valley. Generation upon generation. Each passing on to the next. The tale of their ancestors' journey to the valley. Until the meteors kill them all. The end. Alright, that was a pretty solid movie. I can see why I got a sequel. I don't know about 13 sequels, but hey. As long as it's making money, why not, right? Uh, it was an interesting choice to have some someone narrate parts of the movie. I don't think I've watched many of the older Disney movies, but I don't think I've ever seen them do that before. Um, possibly because this is a movie that needs to follow some rules of science, so the narrator is there in an almost uh, documentary type way. Uh, the dinosaurs hatching in the early scenes were really fun. Uh, Ducky was really cute, Sarah ramming into her parents nonstop. I actually thought Littlefoot was going to hatch too far away from his family and grow up alone, and guys, I've been watching too much Game of Thrones recently and uh, accidentally called Littlefoot Littlefinger. <laughs> I don't know if I kept it in editing, but... Um, yeah, this was a fun and cutesy movie. The little animals fighting over the cherry was fun uh, early in the movie. There's a lot of little details that I like. Uh, Littlefinger sleeping in one of his mother's footprints the night, first night after she dies. Um, the tree star that follows him around forever. It's a representation of his mom. It's cute. Um, but yeah, it's interesting that there are all these rules among the dinosaurs. Like, three horns never play with long necks. Says who? Like, what? <laughs> Uh, it does show how easily influenced kids can be, though, like Littlefinger, Little, little Foot, her, like, three horns never play with long necks, and then later when he meets Ducky for the first time, he, sh he says, like, oh, long, no long necks don't talk to, like, whatever you are. Like, just hearing it a few times from Sarah, and he's, like, ready to emulate her, I'm glad he doesn't, he, like, softens up, though. Um, but, yeah, it just shows how easily influenced kids are by what they hear and the environment they grow up in. Uh, but by the end of the movie, they're all walking, working together, so the mov movie has a bit of a nicer message at the end. Uh, Sarah is probably the least likable out of all the dinosaurs. Just so full of pride and, like, pretty obnoxious. Let's actually do a tier list, like, least favorite to favorite dinosaur out of the group. You guys can comment below what you guys think. Um, so at the bottom, for me, is Sarah. <laughs> and she does get better by the end of the film. I just wonder what the sequels are about. Like, do they undo that work she did, like, growing up a little? Does she, like, revert to the way she was before? Honestly, everybody else uh, I really like. Uh, I think the next one is Spike. He's, like, a gi big, gentle, cute giant. Um, he's still very young, though, so he didn't have any lines. That doesn't... That, that's probably what holds him back from going higher on the list. Uh, next, I have Petrie. He's cute when he learns how to fly. <laughs> I flied? No, you falled. And then, uh, top two. This might be a little surprising, but it's gonna be Littlefoot for me. Uh, he's a good character and has some personal growth, and I like that he went back for his friends even though they went the wrong way and were, like, cruel to him. Or Sarah was pretty mean to him. But, uh, Ducky is just too funny. <laughs> Ducky has to be number one. Yep, yep, yep. <laughs> I feel like she's on the verge of being annoying, but, like, just missed it and is, like, really endearing instead. I bet a lot of people will disagree, though, and think she's, like, super duper annoying. Um, but I'm going to give this movie six point, a 6.5 um, out of 10. Um, unfortunately, IMDb will not, I don't think, allows for half points when you vote. So I might bring it down to a 6 on IMDb, but I'll give it a 6.5 here. Um, if you guys want to watch, uh, vote for the next movie I'll watch. Or if you want to watch the full movie along with me, check out Patreon right here. Right here, somewhere, yeah. Uh, the poll has been up for just a few hours at the moment, but uh, Pulp Fiction is in the lead by a lot. But uh, we'll see for other movies in the future. Uh, be sure to like, comment, share, and subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye, friends.